Hello everyone, welcome to today's vlog. Hope you're all doing well. Just had some breakfast. Honestly, I'm exhausted. I woke up very early today. I'm trying to start waking up earlier. For the past couple weeks, I was like waking up at eight o'clock, like that super easily. But this past week, that's has not been um, the routine. I don't know. I'm so tired. I'm probably gonna go walking in like an hour or so once my food settles a little bit. But before I wanted to do that, I wanted to go back into the kitchen and show you guys how I've been making my homemade brown sugar oat milk shaken espresso. Brown sugar shaken espresso with oat milk. That's how you say it. I really need coffee. It's on my camera but I still wanted to show you guys how to make the drink basically what we're gonna need first is a cup that we can like shake stuff in this is a Starbucks cup and the lid has a hole in it so when I'm shaking I'm just gonna cover the hole with my finger I'm gonna get some ice pour it into the cup definitely add more than you think you would and then this is the best part of it all. This is the brown sugar syrup. If you don't have this, then you're not gonna get the brown sugar taste. It's basically water, uh, brown sugar, and then a little bit of cinnamon. I'm gonna link the recipe down below, but it's crazy how much this really does taste like the actual brown sugar syrup. So I add, depending on my mood for the day, I'll add like two or three tablespoons. Uh, I think that's good. I'll add a little bit more actually. And then pour our two shots of vodka. Just kidding, it's actually coffee. Pop the lid on and shake for like 30 seconds. See how it's like emulsified and the sugar with like the ice and the coffee, it makes this like really foamy texture. Tastes amazing. So we're gonna get our cup. There's still some ice in it. And then we're literally just gonna pour all of this into here. Honestly, you really do need the foam part. That's where most of like the brown sugar taste is. Delicious. Okay, we're definitely gonna get some more ice because I love ice, so I'll be right back. Then we're gonna top it off with some oat milk. Right to the top, right to the top. Pull out my favorite straw. Actually, I think it's being washed right now. It is. So what we're gonna whip out my second favorite straw. <laughs> Look at this, ready? This is the best part, okay? Give it like a half stir. Like just like push everything down. But like, and look at that. A perfectly made brown sugar shake of espresso with oat milk. Like doesn't that just look amazing to you? I don't know. This is just so beautiful. This tastes just like the Starbucks drink, but like 10 times better because it's so much cheaper. like made a u-turn right next to me and i almost cut my pants but i'm safe so at least they didn't try and capture me yeah such a pretty day my cramps are like insane right now oh my god it's horrible and it's like i just worked out usually i always feel really good after a workout i even took a mitol before i worked out too and i still don't feel good so i'm trying to like get myself in a better mood drink this protein shake and then i've been really wanting to try and do the like sleek bun type situation but i haven't been able to like do it honestly it's just been really hard for me because I, I don't know if it's just like my hair type i feel like i don't have the hair to do it because i have a lot of hair i'm gonna follow a tutorial i'm tr like figuring out which one i should do let me 
get hair bands. I don't have hair bands. What am I gonna do? I don't have hair bands. Some regular hair ties. Um, okay, so I think I'm gonna cut open some of these scrunchies because I don't think I'm gonna use a lot of them. What does a hair tie look like? Okay. I'll just use one for now. And then if I need the other one, I'll get it. Or I'll cut it out, whatever. And I'm just creating a mark down my head. I'm making my way up with my hand. Okay, I'm good. Wait, this is actually turning out really good. This is actually turning out really good. See, this is where things go wrong for me. Okay. Put in the scrunchie. It still looks good. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. I got it. I'm gonna like move these little pieces up like that. I did it. Oh my gosh. Wow, it actually came out really good. Like this video. I'm gonna subscribe to her channel because she's amazing. Sagonia. Wow, that's a beautiful name. Sagonia. Lazaroff. Shout out to you. Thank you for teaching me how to do a slick back ponytail. Okay, hairspray. Brush it out and smooth it out. We love a slick back pony. Oh my gosh. The back is a little messed up, like the actual button part, but whatever. At this point, I'm surprised that I was even able to do it in the first place. So I am about to go to the thrift store because I've actually never been to a thrift store. Actually I have, but I haven't been in a really long time. So we're gonna go to the thrift store and then we're gonna get some food. Um, This is the fit. UCLA like graphic tee from H&M. Jeans are Target and then my shoes are my Converse. Fenty Beauty lip gloss and latte lips. Perfect color. It's like my go-to right now. Let me just show you what my dog does because he's not allowed in the rooms because we have carpet and he's a little stinky man. See how he just like sits on the edge of the carpet. He's definitely like one of the funniest dogs we've ever had and that's something that we always talk about. So just got back from the store and I just finished eating. I had a really yummy poke bowl, poke bowl from this place called Sovereign Eat. And I'm also drinking a taro milk tea with tapioca. This is literally the best thing ever. I love boba tea. If you've never had boba tea, you need to try it. This tastes like cereal milk and then the little like tapioca balls are like the best. Now we can do a quick little haul. I didn't end up going to the thrift store because I get nervous. I was like scared to go, to be honest. So I ended up going to Old Navy, went to DSW to see if they had Converse and didn't have my size. So I ended up not getting a pair. Might order them online. There was an Old Navy right next door. So I stopped by there because I, I, I don't know why today I went on Old Navy but I noticed that they were having a lot of sales. So I went to the store cause it was right next to DSW and I got some stuff. So I got this cute little, like, I don't know how I would describe. It's like a, like a, what are those tops called? Um, rib, rib neck. I forgot what they're called, but I got one in this like black color. And then I got one in this blue color. And I just realized that they're actually part of the, their like active wear line. I thought this blue color was really cute. It would be cute with like black leggings or like even a pair of jeans. I feel like you can easily crop these shirts and like make it a cute cute crop top. Then I got this um this like textured shirt with a little like tie in the front. I thought this was really cute just like on a day where you're you don't really want to like get dressed really. When you're feeling lazy, just put this on with a pair of jeans or like a really cute, colorful like pair of shorts. Then I got this like, what is what is this top type of top called? Yeah, so they're like high neck crop tops. So I got this one and it's also part of the active wear. I love Old Navy active wear. You could use this as like a workout top, but I feel like you could also use this just for like running errands. There's like a bra attached to it with some padding. We'll probably take out the padding because Usually the padding always like looks weird depending on what I'm wearing. Those are the four things that I got from Old Navy. I'm very happy because today has been a very productive day. And right now I'm going to start editing this video because I want it to go up by Saturday and it's Thursday. I'm going to start editing this video that you're watching right now so that it can go up on Saturday. Um, my voice is literally going away. I don't know what's going on. 
I'll catch up with you guys later, I guess.